Well, hello from Cambridge and welcome again to the Swamp COVID Recovery Program. As we answer one central question, what is your brand worth in cash? In our first Swamp videos, we looked at the opportunity offered by COVID-19. How what seems to be a dire problem is in reality a unique opportunity to grow cash flow and profits. And we weaponized your brand with a competitive slogan. You've attacked the opportunity by inserting that slogan everywhere you can, and the cash flow and profits are starting to flow back to your business. In phase two, we turn to the long term. It was Ronald Reagan, 40th President of the United States of America, who said memorably, when you're up to your armpits in alligators, it's easy to forget you came to drain the swamp. Business is about making money in the long term too, easily forgotten, today, tomorrow, and until we choose to retire. So how does your brand keep that cash flowing and the profits building sustainably? That is, after all, what we are in business for, no? Well, it does it three ways. Your brand has three cash values. It is, of course, an income generator. It gets you sales. Each time your brand is chosen, there is a sale. Simple. It's a profit center, too. It helps you get a good price, and that gets you margin and pushes profits. But there's something about your brand often overlooked in classrooms and boardrooms alike. Your brand is a financial asset. It is worth money. Okay, your accountant will tell you your brand is an intangible financial asset. Well, who needs an intangible asset that you can't even put on the balance sheet? Well, perhaps a better question is who has an intangible asset or two? And the answer is perhaps surprising and certainly inspiring. There are some happy folk with intangibles worth billions of dollars. Nike worth $30 billion, Coke $66 billion, Google $165 billion, and Apple a measly $214 billion. Of course, you are not Apple yet, but your brand is worth cash, and its cash value can be measured. It's actually quite simple. How much profit you make on each transaction, each sale, factoring in the number of loyal customers you have, and completed with a loyalty factor, essentially an estimate of how many transactions you can expect from a loyal customer. Stir that together and you get an expectation of future profits, and that is worth cash. You could measure your brand's value by employing Interbrand, but that will cost you serious money. Better perhaps our brand value measurement tool, which is free. Well, here is the text. It's pretty busy. You can freeze the video and screen grab these slides, and that's fine. But if you'd like a copy of the text and a simple Excel template, send us an email to swampbusinessplan at gmail.com and we'll email the files back. There's very important stuff to be learned from this tool. Asset value flows from customer loyalty. More loyal customers means more profits and more asset cash value. Differentiating your brand with that slogan gets you chosen, which leads to loyalty and so to profits. In our final video, we go deeper into this loyalty cash connection. Come back and join the masked marketers on the Cambridge ladder to loyalty and profits. Take care and hope to see you back soon.